Sonia again from Leadership HQ. Thank you for taking the time out today to listen to this week's video blog on change. One of my favourite books is called Switch by Dan and Chip Heath. If you haven't had a chance to read it, I'd highly recommend it. They've also got a couple of fantastic YouTube videos on the topic of change. In particular, I like the fact that they do explore it from a neuroscience lens as well. So why do we find change hard? And most of us do. You know, change is hard, but we actually can make it easier. So if we think about the brain weighing only about 1.5 kilos and taking up about 20% of our body's energy, the brain likes the status quo. It likes its habits. It doesn't like to kind of learn or, you know, do new things or think new things because, you know, it just takes too much energy for the brain to change. However, we can change our brains. And it's using different areas such as making sure that we have clarity when it comes to change because the brain loves certainty and clarity. Rewarding our brain. So in terms of the change to occur, what are going to be the opportunities? What are going to be the benefits? What are going to be the rewards? Um, other areas in terms of that help with change is Visualising the outcome of what is going to happen once the change occurs, that is really important. Education is incredibly important as well when it comes to change. So educating people around, you know, what are the benefits of the change? Um, how can we go about making this change a positive outcome for us? I mean, we can change our brains. Um, there's some great research around the areas of neuroplasticity as well that does show us that the brain is, I like to use the analogy like Play-Doh, it's constantly reshaping itself. You know, we are learning new things every day and we're actually hardwiring and creating new wiring in our brains and it's about making sure that we focus on what are the benefits of that change and having certainty, clarity, education and communication around the change. Anyway, I hope that helps. If you're interested in learning a little bit more about the neuroscience of change, please go to my website. There's a couple of great blogs. I've also got some great articles and research on the neuroscience of change, so please reach out to me at info at leadershiphq.com.au. Don't forget you're amazing, and be the best you can be. Thanks again. Take care. Bye.